Okay, so we are back. I got me some yogurt, which is awesome. And also, RTX voice unfortunately muted me a while ago, about half an hour ago. Mm. This is kind of dumb. Also, one second. That's kind of dumb and unfortunate. I'm not happy about it. And I kind of need to keep an eye on that. Just does that sometimes. What did I want to do? So, what I was saying, even though nobody was listening, was that um, basically um, I don't understand why the signal didn't count because I was looking at uh, I was looking at uh, the stone and showed the same signal, right? This one, I think. No, not Giant's Deep. Timber Hearth. Um, but I'll just find a different one. The Hourglass Twins. We'll go to the Hourglass Twins and see if we can um find the signal i haven't been there yet so uh, and i haven't been to giant steep either yeah let's lift off it's still pretty cool to do that every time and gone from the planet that's nice let's set the autopilot here it's a yogurt I am crashing into the sun I hate the autopilot it's killed me so many times I wasn't paying attention I am kind of interested in Giant Steep though. But if we go onto the Hourglass Twins, maybe we'll get more information about what they are because they, they're like containing kind of like a power. Uh, uh, mm. What's it called? power plant or something like this contains something dangerous so I will go to Kent at the market uh, can I not mark the hourglass twins or anything what is happening I can't really Mark anything. Oh, you can heal there. Okay, maybe I need to be in flying. Okay, let's try this again without crashing into the sun, if that is at all possible. While I'm still eating yogurt. Oh, I don't think there's time to eat yogurt. Okay, so. One of them looks like it has a protective shell. The other does not. I was done eating yogurt, so. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna crash into the other hourglass twin, I guess. Hmm. Is 
there somebody out of here? No. Ah, oh, there's a twin. Oh, yeah. That's scary. So I guess uh, the dude. Somebody's here. Ah, shit. I don't know if I'm. Guess I was fine. Guess I'm landed perfectly. Um. Can I fall into the center if you want? I guess so. I have to say I haven't had great experiences with falling into the center of things in this game, so I'm going to try to avoid doing that. Hello, my man. Talk to Chert. Goodness, it's you. Hello. Take it your first launch went well then? Welcome to the hour class, twins. Mind the sand now. What are you up to? Hornfells asked me to update uh, our star charts, so I'm out here observing. I'll look at the wonder uh, interloper. Out here observing, this is one of the best places in the solar system to spot astronomical events, you know? He has a little handkerchief and a spacesuit. That's weird. Uh, what's weird is that I've actually seen a couple of super, supernovae, t uh, supernovae today. Usually, I'll be the fortunate to see it. It be fortunate to see just one. Keep an eye or two out on the stars, and maybe you'll spot one yourself. Yeah, I found something. I found your notes about Atle Rock's main crater. Did you? I hope they were useful. The planet I managed, uh, mentioned may have been frozen solid or just uh, partially made of ice, like a much colder giant's deep. It's hard to say. Uh, it used to be the fifth planet in our solar system. You'll notice, of course, that there's no such planet now. And its place is, and it, in its place is Dark Bramble, which, how to put this, grew into the space of the fifth pla uh, the fifth planet used to occupy. That is, Dark Bramble quite literally appeared at the center of the fifth planet and began destroying it from the inside out. Eventually, the planet shattered completely, and its shards were flung across space. Some of these shards collided with the celestial bodies of our solar system, such as the Adel Rock, which I believe is its biggest crater is how its biggest crater was formed. Oops. Can I look? No. Look at this dude. It does have a lot of telescopes. That is so awesome. I'm just gonna eat some yogurt in celebration. Okay, so one of so I guess the other that's dark bramble. Looks like bushes. So I guess the protective layer we heard, I guess, uh, read about in the last episode was on the other plant, because this one seems pretty unprotected. I still don't know what they were building there, but will be interesting to find out. Okay. I'm 
know what that is. Looks cool there. Ow. A suit punctured by landing on a cactus. A space cactus. Okay, so this needs one of those things. And one of those. Okay, so. Well, it doesn't really tell me much. Okay, so it flies in there. Interesting. Not really helpful. So, I just fell down there, which has not been working out for me in the past. Uh, oh yeah, we were looking for a quantum. There's one. I hear the quantum fluctuations. Go towards them. Oh, I'm going way too fast, and my boost is dead. And I'm dead. Don't die. Not dead. Oh, didn't die. That is the wrong shard. That's way too far away. Okay. Still the wrong shard. A lot of sand down here. So I guess there's not that much down here, just uh, let's just walk up. Okay, this there it is. Red top. Ship? No. Fortunately not. Okay, so I need to go down, I guess. Hmm. Now I'm really paranoid about RTX voice muting me again does do that sometimes okay so I just need to find an entrance here Maybe I don't even need to do that I'm falling sideways no I definitely need to so I'm at the right height isn't there like a little doorway I could go into Maybe if I go in here, we get into an underground tunnel network where I can do stuff. So that would be sweet. Find the shard. Oh, that's fifty percent fuel. That's good. Gonna save some weight. 
it's the wrong direction. It's very interesting. It's not the right direction to go. Colias is missing. He vanished from the lake bed cave, the one at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole, several days ago, and we're unable to find any trace of him. Well, that's interesting. Uh, I don't know how much air he had when he disappeared. I beg any friend reading this help us recover Colias. Second. North Pole or South Pole? Um, North Pole, okay. This rock is a very familiar. Did you travel here, my sedentary friend? Because your unique color and texture appears identical to a rock I met earlier. Uh, wasn't this the same rock fragment in the cave we found at the bottom of the dry lake bed? at the North Pole. Uh, we plan to re-examine the northern lake bed cave. Maybe our friendly rock will meet us down there. An update. Milleray and I went back uh, that's Colise, to the lake bed cave and observed this rock again. Sometimes it's there and sometimes it isn't. It means the rock wanders like a, like the quantum moon does. How curious. So this is the... Okay, so I don't know if this... Ah, I accidentally walked into the cactus and it scared the crap out of me. Okay, so we need to find where Elias died, I presume. Yeah, but first, we need to find some air. Because if we do not, then I shall die too. And the ship is here. Okay, can I get up there? I guess we have to. I still have a lot of fuel, so that's good. Okay. My ship is on the other side. I think I can get over there by just walking, because I don't really have that much fuel left. And my air is not doing so well either. Sixty seconds of oxygen. Yeah. That problem. Oh, there's the ship. Wait, I'll just go in here. This, okay, there's some oxygen and there's some jetpack. Uh, but I need to go back to the ship. The sheep, anyways, because I need to heal. I think you can heal at the ship. Uh. Yeah, I survived. Before I mean dead yet. Okay, so I uh, use med kit, fuel stuff, okay, good. Now, North Pole, here we come. Oh shit, I need to look at the ship's log if I have 
identified the thing as the thing yet. Shirt. Quantum case. Yes, it worked. Okay, what's happening? New entry. Oh, I can mark that on the heart. That's really useful. Know my mind, mind, or from the side. Wait, where is it? The core of Ash Twins was physically sealed off by an immensely thick protective shell. Of oh, Ash Twin. That's the other one. This is fire twin or something like that. Uh, the Nomai mind ore from this side to craft the protective shell designed to physically seal off the core of Ash Twin. Once the shell was finished, the Nomai checked to ensure there was no longer any physical entrances or cracks. Interest. You. The wandering rock was first spotted in a cave at the bottom uh, of the dry lake bed at Ember Twins North Pole. A Nomai named Kulias mysteriously vanished from a cave at the bottom of the dry lake bed at Ember Twins North Pole. Okay. Guess I can't mark that on HUD. I found it but I did find this one so it means that um, that uh, the timber hearth uh, one is not the one in the it's not the one uh, it's not the rock in the museum okie doke Wait, was this here before? But like it wasn't. Wait, why is this filled up now? What? I feel like this changed. Okay, the sand is filling up and I'm dying. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. So, that means. That means that the sand starts from the bottom. And that means that I need to get to to the lake bed very quickly. What's it filling up from though, I wonder. This go nope. Do this, don't do this, then do Frost twins. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Up oh, the doesn't fly to Ash Twin, but I think it's so far away that. But I think the. Um, yes. Okay, so this starts off by being completely empty. It's completely hollow right now. Oops, don't do that. So, probably if I. I want to get to the North Pole, I need to do it now. Okay, we're not very close to the North Pole, which is not ideal. We're way too fast. Don't have that. 
Puncture the suit. Near the North Pole. It's gonna be down there. Place it on the tire. Do I need to go down further? Might. What else? Let's find out. I feel like I'm pretty much very quickly gonna die here. I understand why he vanished. It's his heart. This kind of a maze here where it gets. Oh, there's already dusk everywhere. Please don't crush me, Mr. Dust. Okay, so it's rising already. Try to get out as quickly as I can. I'm not gonna be quick enough. No, I'm out. Let's be nice. Okay. So, I guess that's why they're called the Hourglass Twins. Because maybe the gravity of the one twin fills up the other twin. Something like that, I don't know. But, apparently, don't understand or know what cave they're looking for. We have a little bit of time, I guess, before the thing fills up. It basically happened before I was... happened very quickly. North Pole. I am at the North Pole. Okay, so maybe, I don't know if, I don't remember if I, there's in this cave, there's like two ways to go. And maybe I went in the wrong direction. Well, I went in the direction with the thing. I went here and I kind of looked in here, but I went the other way because it was, holy shit. That's crazy and awesome. I'm not no longer at the North Pole by that much. Okay, so if I want to get back to the North Pole, I have to go here. But that's pretty much where that one thing said that the. Uh, guy was missing it means the, from the lake bed the one at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole That means nothing to me. I don't understand. But the one at the lake bed at the North Pole. I guess I can fill up my feet. Move up. That's like. It's my. Fast. Okay, let's refuel. Okay, so North Pole. Let's go directly. We are pretty much exactly at the North Pole. Bottom of lake bed. I 
bottom of the dried up lake bed. I don't know if the sand's already too high to do much. Is this the lake bed or? might have to go back here when I respawn the next time and just go into the lake bed but I checked that cave at the very bottom and it's just there's nothing there there's just nothing there I guess that's what they mean and I must have missed something. Because otherwise it wouldn't make that much sense, right? But he did say sometimes the rock is there. Hmm. Oh, I don't know. to the other oh, boss this way. Is that ghost matter? So I don't know what they mean. It means yeah, I guess I'll check out the other planet now. Come back to this maybe directly after the next respawn. thing has some weird ass gravity stuff going on because the uh, thing always lands basically I don't think I can shoot it past yet yeah, always follows this thing maybe it just flies into the side now this is a cool can get in here somehow because there's stuff to read. So I guess the idea is that you need to go here at the very very beginning of your respawn and maybe I thought I checked every part of that pretty much what I did. So No. Also, this stick once again. Hmm. Okay, let's. Yes, it's, it's fine. Uh, let's go to ship, and I think the next. I'm just gonna go to the next signal source. Where's the refueling station? Uh, don't need that. So, I don't know what to do here as of now. Try. What? Okay. But this one is Timber Hearth Giant's Deep. So, I'll go to Giant's Deep and see if I can't find anything there a 
Okay, so also, what also, maybe, yeah, let's go to Giant Steep and look at that planet. I've never seen that planet. No, 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 let's go to the other, the other twin first, because I want to see what it looks like. It's really cool that they pour sand into each other. Ooh, what is this? Seems like a model of the solar system. Okay. Don't know what to do with that. Let's go here. Oh, that means that as that planet gets fuller, this one gets emptier and you can access more areas. That's very nice and interesting. That is the wrong side. Oops. Okay. Also, it should mean that the perfect planet will attach to it. It's on stable ground. Makes me feel better inside. Because the ship's taken off on me before, so pretty much. And ran right into the sun. Oh, I can pass. Okay, what did I just do? I don't know what's happening. I feel like I'm... Oh, I'm falling to the other planet now. Oh, shit. Don't do that. That's the Emberton. That's the one I don't want to be at. Because my ship is here. But I'm gonna land on the Ember Twin. It's not ideal. The ship is falling. Something's happening. Did it look like this one was now. Yes, it is. Where did my ship fall off? I shouldn't have just crash into that. Okay, so I bet I. Why did the ship fall? The ship is still falling. I don't really have the... Uh, in, okay. Don't really have the necessary fuel to keep chasing you around. Should probably be fuel before I do anything else. Good. Okay, let's get back to this thing. Oops. Oh, what is this? This is real cool. I haven't even seen that before. So I bet you can reverse the flow of the thing somehow. The reverse of why did the I still don't understand why the ship fell off because I landed it here. Okay. Anyways, I bet you can reverse the flow of sand. Ah, because that happens. Oh, yes, I understand. I wish to not crash. Thank you. Okay, so this is... What's the house? This is the wrong planet. I wish to go towards this planet. Okay, so how do I land? I guess I need to land on one of the holes, I assume. So I'll land on the sand. Very nice, very nice. That is not so nice. Oh, it's just moving towards me. Hope it doesn't hit the ship. It doesn't seem like it. I don't care anyways. The sun's gonna explode at some point. That is so cool. Pretty much what I've said so many times in this game that it's just amazing. 
Okay. So we are here. Okay. Ship is still on the same planet as I am. gonna be run over by the sand thing anytime now. Giant tornado of sand. But I should be pretty close to Okay, so this is the core. That means should get to the bottom of this. some point. Don't know if there's that much more here. Oops. That's where walls would no. So this is the key dope. I just go here and kill. Here's our first delivery Yarrow. One warp core fresh from black from the black hole forge. Root is installing the core sibling on Brittle Hollow as I write this. Okay. One warp core. So I guess that's the black hole that's in the middle of Brittle Hollow and you that teleports you. I wish I could wait here for you to arrive, but the forge and my unfinished work there is calling. I'll return with more materials later. My gratitude, Clary. With this, the Ash Twin project is underway. I confess I'm deeply curious about what you and Poke found on the white uh, hole station that started this project. Could I visit sometime to learn more? Uh, I recommend you do. The white hole station is the model for the towers being built on, uh, for the Ash Twin project. White hole station? Uh, built for, for the Ash Twin project. So a visit to a station would be doubly useful. I suppose more precisely I would like to visit the White Whitehall station with you, Clary. Um, Yero, stop using the scroll wall to flirt with my sister in romantic manners. Her density rivals the neutron stars. And go meet her uh, on the Whitehall station. I'd be happy to uh, explain our findings. Okay, so Oak, Yarrow is the boy, and Claire is the girl, I guess. Ship log. Okay, so I don't know where Whitehall Station is. So if I go to the very bottom here. Kind of confused on where I am at this point, but that's okay. No, I'm in the middle of the thing. Don't do that. No, I want to go back. It's almost in. Okay, I think I am going back. I'm going back at a very fast pace, and I survived. That's amazing. Chief the scout. Okay, uh, so these towers are basically the sun exploding. No, 
These towers are the reason for everything, I guess. There isn't that much sand left. You can't. It needs to dry up now. Okay. okay. So I have. There's very little gravity now, which is funny because it's. It's funny because it's true. No, it's funny because the. That's actually how it's supposed to work. And I'm supposed to go into this tower, I guess. Okay, that just transports me up. Okay, guess not. Okay, I'm on top of the tower. Wouldn't I expect the sand to come back now? Okay, so I think so many mysteries in this game. It's awesome. I'm not dead. Is there anything to read in here? No. Not there. There has to be a reason to go up here I guess I guess we have to go to White Hole Station or so oh White Hole Station that's the place where you end up if you go into the black hole and you die a miserable death so there's just nothing up here Don't die, please. Oh, don't die. Surprise. It's only 0.2 gravity. 0.0 right here. I love it. Oh, the sun is exploding. Okay. Hello, Mr. Explody Sun. That's unfortunate. 